Welcome back. The long-awaited return to the field for Grambling gave them a primetime matchup with primetime himself. Let's see how things played out. Let's travel to the hole. Grambling back on the field for the first time since 2019, welcoming the new look Jackson State Tigers first quarter. After a nice punt return sets JSU up in Grambling territory, it's the first touchdown in SWAC play of the Deion Sanders era. Jalen Jones finds Corey Reed Jr. for the score. Jackson State leads 7 to nothing, but Grambling answers Jeremy Hickbottom, keeping it himself on the read option, and he'll find pay dirt Hickbottom. Rushed for 81 yards and that touchdown there on the ground today. We're tied at seven to the second half now. Grambling leads 28-27 until Jones swings it out to Warren Newman who does the rest. Jackson State regains the lead but the extra point was no good. It's 33-28 after a Grambling punt. Jackson State looking to ice this one. Kimani Clark powering his way to the goal line. But what a play by Quincy Mitchell who forces the fumble to keep Grambling alive. Tigers march all the way down the field to set up a goal to go situation. But Keon Elder loses it. Jackson State's Keontae Hampton recovers and Jackson State survives 33 to 28. So Grambling falls in dramatic fashion. This their first home loss since the 2015 season. And Jackson State also snaps a five game losing streak to Grambling in the process.